Welcome, I'm Nick Shaver with Torch Prep. I'm here tackling 53 on test three. So I want you to pause the video and reread question 53 before we jump into it. Oh my goodness, is your head hurting? I literally gave this question to my wife while I was working on this. And she was like, Nick, I have no clue. I'm glad I'm not, I'm not taking the ACT right now. And she's very successful. You can still be successful and not know these questions, right? That's why this is a silly test. But since we want you to get the highest score that you can so you can reach your future, let's just jump into what is this question asking us. They're trying to confuse you. That All that word, they're trying to confuse you. They ask you, what's the period? And then I think they made it more confusing by like telling you the mathematical definition of what the period is. I feel like if they left this out, it would be an easier question because you would look at it and be think, remind, remind yourself a class. All right, what is the period again? And it's basically, if you remember in class, wave to wave or crest to crest or trough to trough. That's some of the language that I was used in my math class. Wave to wave, or crest to crest or trough to trough. So, boom, look at the two crests starting at zero. The next crest is at pi. So the period, and basically what this is saying is what do you have to add to x such that it's the same. You see? So, I mean, it could be any two points. It's always a pi off where you get to the same point. And then that's how you get your answer of letter B, pi, because that's your period. Good job.